I can't go here. I can't go there. You think you're the only one? I talked to them a million times. They don't listen. But if you tell them, he'll, he'll stop. I mean, what am I going to wear? I'm going to wind up being declared an MIA. They're going to find me in the back of a car somewhere in the weeds. Come on. You know this fucking Tommy all your life. Who knows better than you? This cocksucker is an arch criminal. I mean, when I leave my house in the morning, before I get to the car, I'm looking over both shoulders. This is no way to live. You know I'm no fence jump. I'm around you all my life. You tell me what I got to do. Whatever the fuck I got to do, I'm going to do, no? What could I do? If there's something I could do, don't you think I would do it? You know me. I would like to help you out. I hope so. Sonny, tell him what we talked about. You think it's all right? Yeah, come on. What? Tell him, you know, look, I, maybe you could come in with me. You know, take a piece of this fucking joint. It'd be good. What are you talking about? What do you mean, the restaurant? Yeah, I mean, it, it's a classy place. I mean, look at the layout. When you've been in there a million times, you know what it looks like. I mean, it, Tommy taking over this fucking joint is like putting a silk hat on a, on a pig. I mean, I don't mean no disrespect on that, Henry, but that, that's the way it is. I know you're his friend. Uh, I'm begging you. What can I say? Uh, what am I going to do? What, what, what do you want from me? I don't know what. I don't know anything about the restaurant business. Nothing. All I know is to sit down and order a meal. I don't know how to make a restaurant. No, uh, not for you. It's just a place to hang. You know, I mean, the chef is great. You got to, the fucking shows are good. There's a lot of who is coming in here all the time. I like to help you out. Look, what, what do you want from me? What am I going to do? Tommy's a bad kid. He's a bad seed. What am I supposed to do? Shoot him? That uh, wouldn't be a bad idea. I'm sorry I said that. I didn't mean to say that. I just mean that he's scaring me. You know, I just, uh, I need help. All right, help me, please. You know. You know anything about this fucking restaurant business? He knows everything about it. I mean, he's in the joint 24 hours a day. I mean, another another fucking few, few minutes, it could be a stool. That's how often he's in there. You understand? You want me to be your partner? Yeah. That's what you're trying to tell me? You want me to be your partner? Yeah, what the fuck you think I'm talking about, Paulie? Please, come on. It's not even fair. No? You don't understand. The joint is over. Oh, right, you run the joint. Uh, maybe I'll, I'll try to help you, all right? God bless you, Paulie. Okay. I appreciate it. God bless you. Always been fair with me. All right. Now the guy's got Paulie as a partner. Any problems, he goes to Paulie. Trouble with the bill, he can go to Paulie. Trouble with the cops, deliveries, Tommy, he can call Paulie. But now the guy's got to come up with Paulie's money every week, no matter what. Business bad? Fuck you, pay me. Oh, you had a fire? Fuck you, pay me. Place got hit by lightning, huh? Fuck you, pay me. Also, Paulie could do anything, especially run up bills on the joint's credit. And why not? Nobody's going to pay for it anyway. And as soon as the deliveries are made in the front door, you move the stuff out the back and sell it at a discount. You take a $200 case of booze and you sell it for $100. doesn't matter. It's all profit. And then finally, and there's nothing left. Fucking shame. And you can't borrow another buck from the bank or buy another case of booze. You bust the joint out. You light a match. Any help reaching anything? You look like you're decorating a Christmas tree, you fucking prick. You don't know what it's doing. From five towns. Well, who? Who? The Jew brought Diane. I was telling you about her side. I'm trying to bang this bro for a fucking month now. The only thing is she won't go out with me alone, you know? No. No what? No. No what, Henry? Who the fuck asked you anything? I didn't even ask you anything. At least wait to hear what I'm going to say. All right, what? Okay, what? She don't want to go out with Italians alone. She's prejudiced against Italians. Fucking believe that? In this day and age, what the fuck is this world coming to? <laughs> I can't believe this. Prejudice against... A Jew blood. Prejudice against Italians. Anyway, she won't go out with me alone unless her girlfriend comes with us. I figure you come along and go out with her girlfriend. See, I knew it. I knew it, I knew it, I knew it. You knew what? See what? What the fuck is wrong with that? When is this? Tomorrow night. I can't tomorrow night. I gotta meet Tootie. You could meet Tootie. You could fucking come early and then Tommy, still go. Tommy, Tommy, why do you always do this? Hey, remember that fucking I... Tommy shit? What the fuck I asked you for, Henry? I'm asking you for a favor. I do a lot of fucking favors for you, don't I? I'm trying to bang this fucking broad. You wanna help me out? It's, it's, like, it's... I don't know, did you? What? She's fucking beautiful. Her fucking family, they live in the five towns there. You know, these Jupiter's got a lot of money. Maybe the family owns the whole fucking block. You'll have to wind up with a big fucking score here, you motherfucker. Oh, and no fuck. See? You with your fucking mouth. See? You know what I had a meeting with Tuddy around 11 o'clock, and here I am, a backup guy for Tommy. So how about you, honey? Did you have enough tea? Yeah, it's delicious. Nice. Yeah, just wash it. Okay. Right. You let me watch your figure for you. I couldn't wait to get away.